In this video, I will show you how to install apps from a USB into any smart TV. Now, over here, I have a TCL smart Android TV, but it doesn't really matter the brand or size of smart TV you have. This video should help you install apps from a USB drive to any Android smart TV you have. And even if you use a Google TV, this tutorial is still going to work absolutely well for you. Now first things first, you want to make sure that the app APK you want to install into your smart TV is already contained in your USB drive. You can send the apps APK into your USB drive from your laptop or your PC. Just go ahead and make sure that the apps APK is already contained on your USB drive. Now. In this case, I'm going to be getting the app APK I want to install into my smart TV from my laptop. So basically, I want to connect my USB drive to my laptop. And over here, I have a MacBook. So go ahead and connect your USB drive to a laptop, for instance. And then you just want to go ahead and download and install the APK from the browser of your PC. In my case, I'm going to be downloading the Facebook APK. As you can see, I just downloaded it over here. And then once you download the app APK you want to install into your smart TV from the internet, you just want to go ahead and open up the file explorer or finder app if you're using a macbook just like mine over here so you just want to go ahead and copy the app apk you just downloaded into your laptop or your pc into your usb drive and then just drop it in that particular usb drive and once you have successfully sent the apps apk into your usb drive you want to go ahead and connect the usb drive to your smart tv once the usb drive is connected to your smart tv you're going to see a notification just like this over here indicating that a usb drive has been connected to your smart tv now what you just want to do is to go ahead and open up the file manager on your smart tv if you do not have a file manager on your smart tv you can as well just go ahead and open up the app store or google play store of your smart tv and from the google play store you can go ahead and download and install any file manager like this one over here into your smart tv now go ahead and click on the install button over here and once your file manager is done installing you can go ahead and open it up directly from here or just go ahead and open up any file manager that you already have on your smart tv now over here is my file manager and you can literally see my usb drive that is actually connected to my smart tv over here so i'll just go ahead and select my usb drive over here just like so and then i'll just scroll down and then look for the app apk that i actually sent into my usb drive you can literally see the facebook app apk over here so i'll just go ahead and select it just like so and then give it a minute or two and then click on the settings button over here you also want to make sure that you allow the installation of apps from unknown sources for the file manager as well so come over here and click on allow just like so and then go back to the previous option go ahead and open up the file manager again now try the installation process again and this time you should be able to install the app into your smart tv without any issue and as you can see we have successfully installed this app now into our smart tv from our usb drive now go ahead and click on open and as you can see this app has been successfully installed into the smart tv now for those that their smart tv was unable to detect the usb drive then this problem might actually be from the fact that their usb drive is not on the right format and basically what you want to do to fix this issue is to make sure that you format your usb drive to ms dos fat at 32 using your laptop so go ahead and just format the usb drive and then select the formatting type to be ms dos fat at 32 you can do this with any laptop and trust me after doing this your usb drive should be found by your smart tv if you find this video useful please make sure you smash that like button and subscribe to this youtube channel for more interesting tech tips like this one